Come together in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. First station, Jesus is condemned to death. We adore you, O Christ, and we praise you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Consider how Jesus, after having been scourged and crowned with thorns, was unjustly condemned by Pilate to die on the cross. My loving Jesus, it was not Pilate, no, it was my sins that condemned you to die. By the merits of this agonising journey, I implore you, help me on my journey towards eternity. I love you, Jesus, my, my love above, above all things. I, I repent with my whole heart, heart for having offended you. Never yeah, permit me to separate, separate myself from you again. Grant that I may love you always, and then do with me what you will. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. The second station, Jesus receives the cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we praise you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Consider how Jesus, in making this journey with the cross on his shoulders, thought of us and offered for us to his Father the death he was about to undergo. My most beloved Jesus, I embrace all the sufferings and disappointments that will come my way in this life. By the merits of the pain you suffered in carrying your cross, help me to carry mine with perfect patience and resignation. I love you, Jesus. My, my love above all things. I, I repent with my whole heart for having offended you. Never permit me to separate myself from you again. Grant that I may love you always, and then do with me what you will. Have mercy on us all. Have mercy on us. The third station. Jesus falls for the first time. We adore you, O Christ, and we praise you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Consider this first fall of Jesus under his cross. His flesh was torn by the scourges. His head was crowned with thorns. He had lost a great quantity of blood. He was so weakened that he could scarcely walk. Yet he had to carry this great load on his shoulders. The soldiers struck him roughly and he fell several times. Why, Jesus, it's not the weight of the cross, but of my sins, which have made you suffer so much pain. By the merits of this first fall, save me from the misfortune of falling into mortal sin. I love you, Jesus, my, my love above, above all things. things. I, I repent with my whole heart for having, having offended you. you. Never permit me to separate myself from you again. Grant that I may love you always, and then do with me what you will. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Fourth station. Jesus is met by his blessed mother. We adore you, O Christ, and we praise you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Consider the meeting of the son and the mother, which took place on this journey. Their looks became like so many arrows to wound those hearts which love each other so tenderly. My most loving Jesus, by the sorrow you experienced in this meeting, grant me the grace of, of a devoted love for your holy mother. And you, my queen, who were overwhelmed with sorrow, Obtain for me a tender and frequent remembrance of the passion of your Son. I love you, Jesus, my, my love above all things. I, I repent with my whole heart, heart for having offended you. Never permit me to separate myself from you again. Grant that I may love you always, then and then do with me what you will. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. fifth station the cross is laid upon Simon of Cyrene. We adore you, O Christ, and we praise you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Consider how exhausted Jesus had become. He was on the point of death. But as his cruel tormentors wanted him to die the shameful death on the cross, they forced Simon of Cyrene to carry the cross behind our Lord. My most beloved Jesus, by your grace, I will not refuse to carry the cross. I accept it. I embrace it. I accept in particular the death you have destined for me, with all the pains which may accompany it. 
I unite it to your death. I offer it to you. You have died for love of me. I will die for love of you. Help me by your grace. I love you, Jesus. My, my love above all things. I, I repent with my whole heart for having offended you. Never permit me to separate myself from you again. Grant that I may love you always, then do with me what you will. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Sixth station. Veronica wipes the face of Jesus. We adore you, O Christ, and we praise you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Consider the courage and compassion of the holy woman, named Veronica. Seeing Jesus so ill-used and bathed in sweat and blood, she wiped his face with a towel, on which he left the impression of his holy countenance. My most beloved Jesus, your face was beautiful before, but by the agony of your scourging, crowning with thorns and the carrying of your cross, it has lost all its beauty, and wounds and blood have disfigured it. Through your abundant grace of baptism, my soul was also once beautiful, but alas, I have disfigured it by my sins. You alone, my Redeemer, can restore it to its former beauty. Do this by your passion, O Jesus. I love you, Jesus, my, my love above all things. I, I repent with my whole heart, heart for having offended you. Never permit me to separate myself from you again. Grant that I may love you always, and then do with me what you will. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Seventh station. Jesus falls the second time. We adore you, O Christ, and we praise you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Consider the second fall of Jesus under the cross. This fall renews the pain of all the wounds in his head and limbs. My Jesus, how many times have you pardoned me? How many times have I fallen again and begun again to offend you? By the merits of this second fall, help me to persevere in your grace until death. Grant me the grace of all the temptations in all the temptations which will assail me, to turn to you in prayer for your unfailing help. I love you, Jesus, my, my love above all things. things. I, I repent with my whole heart for having offended, offended you. Never, Never permit me to separate myself from you again. again. Grant that I may love you always, and then do with me what you will. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. The eighth station. The women, women of Jerusalem mourn for our Lord. We adore you, O Christ, and we praise you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Consider the courage of these women of Jerusalem. They wept with compassion when they saw Jesus in such a pitiable state, streaming with blood as he walked along. Jesus spoke to them and said, Daughters of Jerusalem, weep not for me, but for yourselves and for your children. My Jesus, laden with sorrows, I weep for the offences I have committed against you because of the pains they have deserved and still more because of the displeasure my sinful ingratitude caused you who have loved me so much. It is your love more than the fear of hell which causes me to weep for my sins. I love you, Jesus, my, my love above all things. things. I, I repent with my whole heart for having offended you. Never permit me to separate myself from you again. Grant that I may love you always, and then do with me what you will. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. The ninth station. Jesus falls for the third time. We adore you, O Christ, and we praise you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Consider the third fall of Jesus Christ. His weakness was extreme, and the cruelty of his execution is excessive. They tried to hasten his steps when he could scarcely move. My outraged Jesus, by the merits of the weakness you suffered in going to Calvary, give me strength to conquer all human respect and my wicked passions, which have led me to despise your friendship.
I love you, Jesus, my mm. love above all things. Mm. I, I repent with my whole heart for having me offended me. you. Never, Never permit, permit me to separate myself, myself from you again. again. Grant that I may love you always, and, and then do with me what you will. Have mercy on us, O oh Lord. Have mercy on us. The tenth station, Jesus is stripped of his garments. We adore you, O Christ, and we praise you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Consider the violence with which Jesus was stripped by the executioners. His inner garments had stuck to his torn flesh. The soldiers dragged his claws off so roughly that the skin came with them. Have compassion on your Saviour, thus cruelly treated. My most innocent Jesus, by the merits of the torment you have felt, help me to strip myself of all affection for things of earth, that I may place all my love in you, who are so worthy of my love. I love you, Jesus, my love above all things. I, I repent with my whole heart for having offended you. Never permit me to separate myself from you again. Grant that I may love you always, and then do with me what you will. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. The eleventh station. Jesus is nailed to the cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we praise you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Consider how Jesus is roughly thrown down upon the cross. He willingly extends his hands and offers his life to his eternal Father as a sacrifice for our salvation. Those barbarians nail his hands and his feet to the wood and then raise the cross and allow him to die in anguish. My Jesus, loaded with contempt, nail my heart to your feet, that it may ever remain there to love you and never more to leave you. I love you, Jesus, my I love above all things. things. I, I repent with my whole heart for having offended you. Never, never permit me to separate myself from you again. Grant, grant that I may love you always, and, and then do with me what you will. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Twelfth station, Jesus dies on the cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we praise you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Consider how Jesus, after three hours of agony on the cross, is consumed with anguish, abandons himself to the weight of his body, bows his head and dies. O oh, my dying Jesus, I kiss devoutly the cross on which you died for love of me. I have merited by my sins to die a miserable death, but your death is my hope. By the merits of your death, give me grace to die embracing your feet and burning with love for you, I commit my soul into your hands. I love you, Jesus, my, my love above all things. I, I repent with my whole heart for having offended you. Never, Never permit me to separate myself from you again. again. Grant that I may love you always, and then do with me what you will. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. The thirteenth station. Jesus is taken down from the cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we praise you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Consider how, after our Lord had died, two of his disciples, Joseph and Nicodemus, took him down from the cross and placed him in the arms of his afflicted mother. His mother Mary received him with unutterable tenderness and pressed him to her bosom. O mother of sorrow, for the love of this son, accept me for your servant and pray for me. And you, my Redeemer, since you have died for me, permit me to love you, for I wish but you and nothing more. I love you, Jesus, my, my love above all things. things. I, I repent, repent with my whole heart for having offended you. Never permit me to separate myself from you again. 
Grant that I may love you always, and then do with me what you will. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Fourteen station. Jesus is laid in the sepulchre. We adore you, O Christ, and we praise you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Consider how the disciples, accompanied by his holy mother, carried the body of Jesus to bury it. They closed the tomb and all came sorrowfully away. My buried Jesus, I kiss the stone that entombed you. But I believe that you rose again on the third day. I beseech you by your resurrection to make me rise in glory with you at the last day, to be united with you always in heaven, to praise you and love you forever. I love you, Jesus, my, my love above all things. things. I, I repent, repent with my whole heart for having offended you. Never, never permit me to separate myself from you again. again. Grant that I may love you always, and then, then do with me what you will. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Stations are never complete, I feel, without mentioning the 15th station, Christ is risen. That is what makes sense of all that went before. And here, behind the church wall, is the Blessed Sacrament. Christ present in our midst, the risen Jesus with us. Victor over sin and death. That is our hope. That's what makes sense of all that went before. Suffering without any meaning is of no value. The suffering of Christ has great meaning. It won our salvation. Let us pray now for our Holy Father's intentions and remembering all the victims of the coronavirus. Our Father, who art in heaven, heaven hallowed be thy name. name. Thy, thy kingdom come, thy, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and, and forgive us our trespasses, as, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit.